to Bistro Buzz TV. Today I'm going to show you a different version of a cake that you can make with some of the items that we have purchased from Dollar Tree. We had the blueberry muffin mix. We also had the funfetti cake mix. And we also had the strawberry flavored cake mix. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take each of these just like I did in the, the other video. I'm going to bake these on 350 for about 20 minutes and then we're going to take them out of the oven and we will be right back. Each of the cakes have baked. This is the strawberry, this is the blueberry, and this is the funfetti. What I'm going to do now is let these cool and then we will take them out of these pans and then we will stack them. And what we're going to do is stack these. The strawberry will be on the top, the funfetti will be the second layer, and the third layer is going to be the blueberry, and I'm going to put Cool Whip in between them. Cool Whip is actually going to be the icing on these, so I've got to wait for them to cool completely, and then I will put the Cool Whip on them, and then what we'll do is we'll start, store them in the refrigerator. So I wanted to give you a variation of doing like the three-tier cake versus the bunny that we made in the earlier video. So we will be back once we start placing the Cool Whip on each of the different cakes and I'll show you what it will turn out to be once we complete that. Here we have the blueberry on the bottom, the middle we have the funfetti, and in the top we have the strawberry. And what I have done is I've placed these into a glass dish. And what I'm gonna do is store these overnight in the refrigerator. And then I need for the cake to get very, very cold so that when we put the Cool Whip on there, it will not melt. So what I'm gonna do is store these overnight and we will be back to put the Cool Whip on them. And you'll actually see what they look like once we're completed decorating the cakes. This is the cake plate that I'm going to be using. I purchased this cake plate at Marshall's several years ago. It is gorgeous. It's so colorful. I love it. And this is what we're going to be using. I'm taking one of the containers of Cool Whip and I'm adding the French vanilla jello pudding mix to it and mixing that up. I took the first layer, which is the blueberry, and I placed the Cool Whip on the blueberry muffin mix and then I took the funfetti and I placed the Cool Whip on that and then I placed the top layer is the strawberry cake and I placed the Cool Whip on that. I put the Cool Whip between the layers and you'll see that the Cool Whip starts coming out between the layers and you just continue to go around the cake until it, it looks smooth, the Cool Whip. And you'll see here that I did put pecans on top of it too, which made it really, really nice on the top of it. You can place any toppings on the cake. You can use strawberries, you can use blueberries, anything that you wish. And then it just makes it very, very pretty for the presentation. But I just use pecans on this. But I really like this idea. You can use different kinds of muffin mix. You can use cake mixes and just mix them up to make it very, very colorful. But I had to keep going around and trying to get the Cool Whip to look correctly. And I finally got it to where I liked it. And I tell you, the cake plate kind of makes it, it, it just makes the presentation. I really, really love this cake plate. But this turned out really, really good. I really like the blueberry muffin mix on the bottom. I've never done that before. I've usually used the cake mixes on for each of the different layers, but this time it was the muffin mix on the bottom. So what, what I think I'm going to do next time is use two or three different muffin mixes because it really, really did turn out good using the muffin mix. You can see here how the cake actually looks. It turned out really, really good. Actually a little bit better than what I thought it would be. But I just really liked using the Cool Whip instead of the icing too, because some people don't like the, the sugar in the icing. But then when I cut it, you can see here the different layers. You've got the strawberry, the funfetti, and the blueberry on the bottom. It's so pretty once you get it cut and you see the different colors of the cake. I tried to capture some pictures where you could actually see it. You'll be able to see it in this one just a little bit better. But the funfetti in the middle made it a little bit fun too. And you can see all the different colors and made the different layers look actually better with the funfetti and the different colors 
that the Funfetti has in it. If you decide to bake a cake like this, please leave a comment below and let us know what flavors you use. Would you use all cake mix or would you use all muffin mix or would you use a combination like we did? Cake mix and muffin mix. And what icing would you use? Would you use Cool Whip like we did or would you use a different flavor and icing? So thank you very much for visiting Bistro Buzz TV. Come back to visit us again soon and please like and subscribe. Thank you.